On Friday, August 2nd, Pikeville Community Kitchen will be hosting a back-to-school backpack and care package giveaway. The event will take place in downtown Pikeville at the Pavilion on Main Street in front of the Appalachian Wireless Arena at 11 a.m. Food and drinks will be provided and supplies are first come, first serve. This Friday at 11, we are going to be doing a back-to-school bash type of giveaway. We're going to be giving away some school supplies and we're also going to have some of our first responders there and we are going to combine it with our blessing bag giveaway. Um, we had it planned for today, but we had some delays. So it's going to be a two for one type of deal. We're just going to have a bunch of fun over at uh, their arena at the pavilion. Um, we're going to have a bunch of our partners and volunteers that's going to come help us. We're going to have the first responders, um, just like the Pikeville Police Department, as well as the Pikeville Housing Authority, or, or just some, a few. Uh, volunteers and sponsors that we're going to be having on Friday. Norton Eye Center in Pikeville, your local vision experts. Experienced doctors using state-of-the-art technology. Choose from top designer frames from Oakley, Ray-Ban, Nike, and more. We accept Medicaid and Medicare. Plus, most insurances are accepted. Norton Eye Center in Pikeville, next to Tractor Supply. This will be the seventh annual Back to School Bash the Community Kitchen has organized. Members of the Community Kitchen take pride in the opportunity to provide for others. This is going to be our seventh annual Back to School Bash giveaway. So we always like to do this event because it kind of helps our parents and our volunteers and everyone in the community. And we're just happy that we're able to do that with such great sponsors uh, that we do have. And it's always a joy for us to do so. Well, we always expect to great turnout and we always have a great one. It's always so fun, all of us being together, especially with the kids. Um, it's just heartwarming and we're happy that we're able to do it because it is something that is needed and we're happy to be able to do this for the community. Reporting for Mountaintop News, I'm Nick Collum.